guys, it's Minx here. Hope you're doing well. And welcome to Dreadout, Keepers of the Dark. This is the third chapter in the Dreadout series, and my guys over on GameWisp have voted for this as the main indie game they would like to see this month. So that is what we are going to be playing. I hope you guys enjoy. If you want to vote yourself, you can head over to GameWisp by hitting the support me link in the description right now. And if you want to see my playthrough of the first two chapters of Dreadout, you can hit the link in the description for that too watch those first. Even though, if I'm honest with you, the story is pretty crazy. I'm not really even sure what the story is myself. We're a girl with a cell phone that kills ghosts. And and that's about it, really. I can summarize it. It's like an indie version of Fatal Frame. Anyway, we're going to play now, and hopefully things will make a bit more sense as we dive into this. I already made one save game to test things out, but we're going to jump in. One thing I will say is the subtitles don't seem to work, but hopefully they will eventually. <laughs> they don't seem to work even though they're on, so we'll just have to wait and see, guys. Maybe that's just a bug or something. This place, it's never empty. The power it contains is not diminished. And its keepers never sleep. With all the sacrifices I've made, I will not return empty-handed. Not this time. It's been too long for the uninitiated there will be many hardships. Okay, we just uh, woke up, it seems. When you die in this game, you have to head towards the white light to respawn. This is the sort of scene we seem to have here. Interesting. One thing I will say is the plot of this game is very, very, very unusual. I I can't really explain anything that happened. There was a bunch of school kids and they were on a school trip and they go in this building and one of them gets possessed and all kinds of weird crazy shit happens and after that I'm not really sure to be honest with you. There are ghosts and they're mean and yeah they're ghosts. Ooh spooks. Oh ah okay and this that's arriving this is like a flashback thing. Hello everyone. I think most of you are dead now. If not all of you, actually. Spooky! Oh. Um, Miss Siska? Where are we? I really wasn't expecting there to be a bridge here. That complicates things a bit. Done was taking a left turn initially, turned right at the intersection, and then went straight before turning around and making a left instead of a right. Know it all? Clever mouth. Yeah, I guess that's like the things they said when we first arrived. Heading into the light. I wish to be reborn. Consume me, light. Ah! Well, this place looks really fucking welcoming. Dread out keepers of the dark, realm of the unseen. From what I understand, the basis of this game is we're going to be fighting several, I think a lot, of like boss ghosts. I think the whole point of this game is boss fights. You fight a shit ton of ghosts. It's not finished yet. Okay, and we get pieces of this mirror maybe to rebuild them. And, uh, yeah, so we have room 104, 103, 102. Oh, hi. Hi there. How do I take pictures? This guy's having a great time. Hi there. Ooh. I guess no one told you why you're here. Well, neither will I. Not that I know anything. I'm glad you're admitting that, that at least as well. I'm not even sure if this is the direct continuation for the games. It could just be like a standalone thing to show you some more of the sort of like the folklore surrounding this game, which in itself would be pretty cool because it would make more sense. 
So we've got loads of rooms. I'm guessing each one of these rooms is a different boss fight and we have all eight of them to get through. It's room 108. I guess we'll start on the left and work round. So this will be room... I guess it makes sense to start at room 101 seeing as it goes up from 101. So 101 it is. Are you sure you want to enter this realm? Okay. I'm not really that sure I want to enter this realm, but I guess we'll just uh, see which creature awaits us on the other side. Tatapan Kemetian, the Death Gaze. Well, this place sounds lovely. I think a blue glow means there's helpful items. Our cell phone battery actually seems to have gone down for like the first time ever, which is, uh, you know, interesting. Definitely something over there. Oh yeah, this. Slither sisters, midnight lurkers, mother tangled to a twine. We are many, we are one. Boiled cold spine shivers. In our home, dare not enters. Seek not for mother's wrath. A watery grave you shall have. Mary, 4th grade, Rawa Kailong Elementary School. I can tell you, if Mel Mary in the 4th grade wrote that, I think Mary might have some issues. I'd probably inform her parents if I was her teacher. There's an ominous looking fucking tunnel over there. I can hear some kids laughing as well. Kids. Always fucking kid ghosts, isn't it? It's always kid ghosts. Hello, Mira. I think I just accidentally went back to the main world. Okay, so we're now back in this place. No more going through mirrors. Just running around in shallow water. Oh god. Is it kids? I really hope it isn't kids. I fucking, I fucking, I fucking hate kids, guys. Problem is you can't actually see them unless you have your camera out, but if you have your camera out you walk really slow, so it's like a... Oh shit. Shit, there's something here. Something here. Oh fuck. Fuck! Oh god. I've got a head by a fire floating head. Great. Okay. Camera. Cooperate with me, please. Come on. Ow! That fucking head had some rugby training. Jesus, come on! Is it dead? Is it dead? Okay, it went back into the water, I think. There was like a blue light that went out. I don't think I killed it, otherwise there'd been like a ah! noise, you know, like a ghost noise. It's the noise ghosts make when they die. Ah! Anything in here? Just like an altar of some kind. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, there is a head. There's a head up ahead. A head up ahead. It's just peeking out the it's just chilling out there, it's just peeking out the water. It's just like, yeah, I'm just gonna sit here. I'm just gonna smoke a blunt, smoke a doobie. Uh that's what goes thing. Okay, I pissed it off now. Come on. Come on, little laughing head, come a little bit closer. Come on, little laughing head. There you go. One hit. One more. I should make it go away again at least. If this is the boss, this is the shit fucking boss. Like just chase a head around. Is that it? Yeah, okay, it's gone. Awesome. So now I have to find it again, I guess. This is just like a labyrinth of water on both sides of that big room. So, um... More heads to find. Oh, I, I wonder if it's the same... I mean, assume it's the same head. Must be. Okay, down here. We haven't checked this side yet. Okay, well, there's definitely some shit down here. There's a head. There's a head. That's a different laugh. There's a different laugh here, too. There's a head laugh and a different laugh. Fucking laughing ghosts. The head's fucked. Okay, good. Fuck off. Okay, go away. You gone? Good. Yeah, there's definitely something else. What the fuck is it? What the fuck is it? Oh god, stop laughing! It's not funny! Oh my god, shut up! 
That's like one of the most horrific laughs I've ever heard. It's worse than mine. Well, there's another head. The head's over there. Fuck. Fucking fuck. Just go away. Go away. Come here. Oh gosh, she's teleporting. She's teleporting. She's teleporting. Where the fuck is she going? Where did she go? Where did she go? Where did she go? Linda, get your fucking ass out of here. Where the fuck is she? Teleporting ghost. Oh gosh, she'd be right behind me. Ah! Go away. Sounds like she fucked off behind me, right? Is she behind me? Hello? That cough abruptly. What the fuck? Hello? Okay, teleporting ghost. I guess maybe stepping out of there, like, reset her or something. As we'll soon find out. Let's go and try and get the other head. I'm very wary. I don't want to step out of camera view in case uh, she runs at me through a wall or some shit. I can't hear her laugh today. You know what? <laughs> that, that one. Can't hear that at all. Okay, I can hear the face laughing over there, the head. Alright, come on, head. It's you and me. If you really are the boss, I'm expecting you to have some tricks up your sleeve here. Come on, little head, come on. Come, no, fuck. I need to put the camera away. That's one hit. You can attack on me, huh? I must admit, since that first encounter, it seems to have done absolutely fuck all. Is it gone? Awesome. Whoa, it got really dark really quick suddenly. What the fuck? Okay, we're back out here. Oh god, there's multiple heads. There's multiple heads. There's. Oh my god, there's a really fucking big head. I guess that's the boss. Oh my fucking god. What is it? Oh, it's this hair. The other heads are on the end of its hair. I must have been killing like strands of its hair. Fuck. It was like under the water and... Oh my god, this is bad. Look at its... Fu oh! Am I dead? Oh god, that damaged me. Don't look at it! Linda, don't look at the fucking evil eye thing! Don't look at it! Okay. Fuck off. Right. Take pictures. What am I taking pictures of? I don't know if I should be killing the hairs off or fucking... I don't know. Oh god, look at the way it moves. Right. Look away. Look away. Looking away seems like a good practical idea. Look away from its laser beam. It's doing the Cyclops thing from X-Men. Oh, I hit it. I hit it. I hit it. Oh fuck. I got hit by that again though, I think. Just keep looking at the wall. Just keep like keep eye contact on the wall, and everything is going to be just fine. Right. I need to get closer. I think it keeps lying down after it zaps me. Come on, take pictures. Why isn't this? Do need to be closer? Damn it! Come here. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Getting closer is about it. Just, just, just smile. Just fucking smile. Oh god, here it comes again. Here it comes. Look away. Look away. Look away. In this case, red is dead. Red is dead. Red is dead. Okay, stop doing the red thing. I've got to take a picture of it again. Fuck off! Go away! Fucking... I'm so bad at aiming. Come on, bring it. Right, get ready for another dodge. Oh, I hit it! I hit it! I hit it! Good. <laughs> ah! Jesus Christ! Just fucking knock me out of my fucking boots or whatever I'm wearing! Shoes! Fuck! Why are wearing heels? Fucking... Jesus Christ, okay. I think I'm a few hits away from dying, but I think I've got it on its fucking... I think I've got it on its... I was saying it's like back feet now, but it hasn't got any feet. I've got it on its floating disembodied head now. Just keep moving so the charge effect doesn't hit me and avoid the laser. Seems to be the general gist of things to do here. I can do that. I can I can avoid lasers. There you go. Smile! Fucking smile, bitch! Oh fuck. What the, what the fuck? That was the worst aiming ever and I got rugby tackled by another fucking floating head just now. Fucking... Oh god! Run, 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 run! Run, 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 run! It's gonna do the laser soon. It's, gonna, it's trying to charge at me at the moment. Just keep moving. Just avoid the charges. There's a laser. Okay, as soon as it lasers, it's gonna flop on the floor like a fucking little headfish. I'm gonna take about a million pictures of it and I win. Right, here we go. Get closer. There you go. Zap it. Come on. More. More. Ah! Ah! There you go. I think it might be dead. Please be dead. Please be dead. You don't look well at least, so that's a plus. I mean, you didn't look that good before, but you look even worse than before now. I think I just won. There's still heads there, shit. Have I won? 
Oh yeah! Dark Souls style, Spirit Banished. That's pretty awesome. So that fight was a giant disembodied head. Awesome. I hope we actually learn more about this ghost like after we defeat each one. That would be interesting. I don't know if that, that chick I killed that teleported was related to that or not, but... Oh, we got cutscene. This is the teacher from the original who I, I thought was also possessed by someone. I, I have no fucking idea. But this fucking plot is a mess. If anyone can explain to me, I guess that means I defeated something, like uh, Ghost defeated. So they're called Keepers, I'm assuming that's why it's called Keepers. Oh yeah, I'm back here, awesome. There we go! That's the first Keeper defeated, and uh, only what, seven more to go? Seven more lovely, friendly Ghosts to, to help. This guy's going to be a source of information, a source of bountiful information, I can tell you that now. Cammy was once a beautiful woman. Her vanity was her beauty, particularly her long flowing hair. She had so much pride in them that she would never let anyone but herself touch it. The mere sounds of shears of scissors would cause her alarm and generate fear and anger. Her beauty made many men wish to court her, but she was never interested in romance. Until one day she encountered a very special man she fell for. Unfortunately, the feeling wasn't mutual. She then stalked him and his girlfriend to find out would it that draw what it that's not even English what it is that draws him to her certainly not her beauty she tried to find out what it is that's so special about her in the end she grew frustrated and she needed to inspect her more closely she proceeds to behead the woman she took the time to study her beauty especially her hair but found no particularly exceptional quantity qualities interesting hi guys Mix here hope you enjoyed this installment of dread out keepers of the dark. If you did, remember to hit that like button. It would really help me out if you did. And we'll continue with this series very fucking soon. There'll be more of this hopefully every day. And uh, Danganronpa and Heavy Rain will also be continuing and concluding as soon as possible. So uh, stay tuned for those as well. Don't worry, they have not been abandoned or anything like that. Anyway, um, I hope I'll see you soon, guys. And if you want to support me, uh, vote on my future AAA and indie let's plays you can do so by heading over to gamewisp.com forward slash minks or clicking the support me link in the description right now there's various other reward tiers as well where you can get various cool shit so go check it out and i'll see you guys really soon have a great day bye for now